I never envisioned creating an app. My name is Scott Speed and my background is in education. Uh, I'm a teacher and I'm an entrepreneur. Uh, I've always done both in some capacity. And my personal mission statement is to be a positive force in the lives of others. Growing up in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, I had a large family. My mother's side of the family uh, was in Philadelphia and she had 10 siblings. So that means I had a lot of cousins. And we got together during the holidays. Uh, you know, for all the holidays, we came together at my grandmother's house and it was something we really looked forward to. And you know, we developed some really tight bonds growing up. And I truly value those relationships uh, that I've been able to, you know, that, I, that we were able to form as, as children. In elementary school and high school and even in the old neighborhood, you know, I was one of those people that I was always a people person and I really valued uh, my friendships growing up. Um, you know, I was that kid that you know, always had friends over to the house. Uh, I was always the kid who, uh, you know, we played video games in my house or we played football outside or we played board games. When I went away to college, it was, it was my first time, you know, obviously like most people, leaving and, um, you know, not only was I able to maintain some of those friendships from high school and from the old neighborhood, but I was able to develop some other really, really tight friendships, uh, some brotherhoods and sisterhood uh, friendships that I still maintain today, more than 10 years later. Uh, met some really great people in college um, that, you know, we're still great friends today. And in addition to that, as I got into the workforce and also into the business world, uh, I was able to meet a lot of really great people. And, um, you know, I, I, I truly value every one of those friendships, every one of those relationships, because I truly believe that, uh, you know, we're, as human beings, we're, we're only as good as the people around us. So I always try to keep good people around me and I always value when awesome people come into my life. Five for Friends um, actually is something that, uh, you know, literally it kind of came out of nowhere. Um, just recently, in March of this year, my wife and I um, had the unfortunate loss of our third child. Uh, we were expecting uh, our third child uh, in, in August, in this summer, and uh, unfortunately, due to some unfortunate events, we, we lost our, our baby girl because she was born prematurely. And it was a devastating uh, loss, it's something that I, I really never even thought I would experience you know, as an adult, and I wasn't prepared to experience it in any way. Uh, but when it happened, I actually you know, I went to social media. It was an easy way for me to, to, to share with all my family and friends, you know, what was going on because a lot of them knew. And rather than me make a bunch of phone calls, uh, I just simply posted on Facebook what had happened. And we got an overwhelming, uh, you know, response in terms of support, condolences, thoughts and prayers. And what was interesting was we had a lot of individuals post, you know, comments on Facebook, send us inbox messages. Um, a lot of people text me and send me emails, but there were literally a handful of people, probably about five or six people that actually picked up the phone and called me. And that was so meaningful to me. It was so uh, meaningful because some of those individuals I actually hadn't spoken to in five, six years. And when I heard their voice, it was just like, it was it was just amazing because it was a higher level of communication. And, you know, we had gotten so used to just texting or, you know, liking on Facebook or commenting on each other's family pictures. You know, we had communicated over the years, but when I actually heard their voice, it was amazing. I got a phone call from a friend uh, named Fran Meisner, and she and I hadn't spoken in probably about six years. And it meant so much uh, for her to call me. And it was one of those conversations when we said to each other, you know, we shouldn't have to wait for a time like this to talk. And, you know, we talked about, you know, we caught up a little bit about family and things like that. And it really got me to thinking, you know, just because we get older, uh, you know, we get family responsibilities and work and life responsibilities. 
it doesn't mean that we should have to just, you know, uh, be able to lose all those uh, communication lines that we used to have. And my brain got going as soon as I hung up uh, the phone with Fran. Uh, within literally 15, 20 minutes, Five for Friends was born. Five for Friends is a revolutionary social networking mobile app designed to make it easy and convenient to verbally keep in touch with family and friends. It's all centered around a five-minute phone call and a mobile app social environment where you've connected with all of your real friends and family, people who you genuinely want to talk to from time to time. When you open the app, you'll be able to see which of your friends and family have indicated, I got five. This lets you know that they are available and feel like talking so that you can touch bases instantly through the app without the worry of it taking too much of your time because our technology will limit the call to five minutes. Five for Friends is intelligent and efficient because when you feel like talking and have as little as five minutes, you will no longer have to worry about getting a voicemail or playing phone tag. You will know exactly who can talk and when they are available. And by compressing time frames to five minutes, you can keep in touch with more people more often. Think about it. On a 30-minute car ride home from work, you could potentially connect with six friends. That's powerful. Supporters of the Five for Friends Indiegogo campaign can help us in several ways. Uh, the first way is by choosing a perk or reward. Uh, you're contributing to bringing this concept to life. Uh, you know, we have developers lined up, we have designers lined up, and it's just a matter of us getting the uh, capital necessary to actually put things in motion. Uh, your support, you could also support us by sharing this campaign, telling everyone you know in your social media uh, sphere about the campaign, sharing the campaign, sharing this video, uh, sharing it through email, through Facebook, uh, through Twitter, through Tumblr, any social media, Instagram, any social media uh, influence that you have. If you can just tell people to come and check out our campaign, that will do wonders for us.